Good evening. Welcome to my laboratory. But what you're looking at there is uh, a wonderful thing about digital scopes. It's a digital artifact. Uh, and what I'm doing is I'm scoping a little uh, phase lock loop circuit that's resonating um, an air core coil at its natural resonant frequency. And uh, what you're seeing there is kind of a special display. Let's see, here's, here's the circuit that we're working with right now. Sorry about the light. But that's the coil. And that's the phase lock loop circuit right there. And because of the way I have the scope set up, we're seeing this wonderful display of digital artifact. Let me show you the signal that we're actually looking at here. Um, first I'll change the display back to vectors, then I'll change the time base to a time base that actually shows us the signal we're looking at, which is that. But through the wonders of digital aliasing, by going to a very much slower time base and selecting dot display with a 200 millisecond persistence time and in the acquire menu we have averaging 16 averages and full memory depth of 24 um, mega points we see this wonderful wonderful display of digital artifacts. Now I'm going to move my hand close to the coil. It changes things quite a bit. Now my hand's removed. Let's see if I can get it even a different time base here. changing the time base. So this is an interaction between the memory depth, the uh, averaging mode, and the time base display, which turns this, which is the approximately correct signal, except with dots, into wonderful chains of dots.